Right then, let's try this again. Really sorry about that. The last video I uploaded, I hadn't got my microphone switched on. Uh, I didn't realise, so it was just a lot of moving about and no sound. So sorry about that. So what I was saying, and I'll say it again, is I've got you some free value bets um, for the English Championship today. Because I'm late now recording this or uploading it, the Fulham one's already started, so we'll crack on. This is using the Poisson distribution model to identify value bets, so not just bets that we think... Uh, are going to win so not just teams that we think are going to win which would obviously be Fulham in this case we're only looking at value where we think we're getting more value from the bookies than our odds suggest our own odds that we've created suggest so for the Fulham game um, I've laid Fulham at 1.36 with a £10 liability and that would return £27.79 profit because as you can see here we're getting better odds for the draw and the away win than we think we deserve if you like for Huddersfield um, and the, the odds for Fulham are lower than we deserve so we've laid that and we're looking for the value there and then Blackburn Millwall there's value in a Blackburn win uh, at 2.14 so £10 returns £11.40 profit because we can see here Blackburn are favourites but they're also quite a lot of value in the Blackburn uh, odds so 2.14 when we're thinking we should only get 1.75 so we're putting ten pound on that, and that'd return eleven forty. Uh, Bristol Middlesbrough, we're going to lay Middlesbrough again. They're the favourites in terms of what the uh, bookies and the value suggests. We're going to who's going to win the game, but there's no value there uh, in actually betting on them with the prize being offered. But there is value with Bristol and the draw, so we're going to take that on at ten pound liability, which would return nine twenty six profit. Cardiff Blackpool, another lay here. Um, the Blackpool. Odds are, are way higher than we think they should be. Um, Cardiff are on a good run at the moment, so I mean, stats aren't everything, are they? This is a, a, an interesting one. It, it's it's one that I don't know. If you're just going by the by the data, then you can put it on. If if you're wanting to use a bit of your match analysis, then you might you might think twice. But I'm going to be uh, suggesting laying Cardiff in this one at 2.04 to return 962. Um, it'll be flat stakes, ten pound across the board here. Um, Stoke. Birmingham, I don't like betting on Blues to win because they always disappoint me. Uh, but I've, without having any sort of bias here, the the value bet suggests a Stoke win, uh, and I'm happy to take that on. It's what the odds suggest. So ten pound would return eight pound sixty profit. Country Barnsley, the slight value in Country winning. Um, it depends how much profit you want to take from your bets if you think it's worth putting this on or not. Um, 1.57 so there is value but it's only slight and it's still a very uh, short short price so £10 would return would put my teeth back in would return £5.70 Derby Peterborough this is my better of the day if you like I, I think Derby are way longer than they should be there uh, we've got them at 1.27 and they're at 1.94 um, Peterborough are nowhere near as, as long as it looks like they should be according to our odds so I'm going to have value in the Derby win at 1.94 which would return £9.40. Luton, West Brom, a tricky one this. Uh, I don't normally like to oppose teams like West Brom because they've got so much quality in the team, but they're not on a great run. The new manager bounce isn't really going to bounce that high, I don't think, because it's not brought a feel-good uh, feel factor to the club, I don't think, with the appointment. And Luton, they're strong, um, and at home especially, so 3.45, I like that. Uh, £10 returns £24.50. Preston Reading, there's not enough here to justify any bet really. There's there's a bit of value in the Reading price, but it's still they're still long shots, so I wouldn't be getting involved there. QPR Hall, there's value in the draw, but I only put draws on from my MBM draw system and this hasn't come up in that, so I'm not interested in the draw on its own. But I will take on the uh, lay of QPR at one point nine three to return ten pounds seventy five profit. Sheffield United to Andy, there's nothing there, there's, there actually are no value bets, it's not even a judgement call, uh, everything's spot on really, it's quite encouraging because it means the Poisson pack can predict pretty accurately in line with the bookies, um, so yeah, there you go, this is a quicker video than the last one as well, so I've cut through it a bit quicker, sorry about that, uh, the mess with the last one, but there you go, hope you enjoy it, please like and sub subscribe, leave a comment and uh, I'll see you soon.